afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Weybridge Square and the launch of the Victoria Crescent fundraising event, which is going to start now and continue uh, today and tomorrow until 10 o'clock. Um, on the uh, stage with me is Mrs. Anna Godlewska, who is Deputy Director of the Polish Cultural Institute uh, and is representing the Polish Embassy uh, together with her colleague from London and Craig Delahaye, a uh, husband of Marta Delahaye and father of Julie. Uh, I don't need to uh, tell you why we're here. You will all be aware of the uh, shocking events in St. Helia, uh, which have left the community uh, very distressed. Um, and of course, our sympathy to the victims, uh, to, to Craig and his family, and the victims of the, uh, the others, Marek, Isabella, Kinga and Caspar uh, is heartfelt and I have in my hand the book of condolence that has been at the town hall uh, since a few days after the tragedy. This is going to be uh, here for the duration of the weekend. If you haven't signed it I would encourage you to, to, to do so but also have a look through at some of the comments. Um, I was doing that this morning and I'll just read out what the Chief Minister said. I'm sure I speak for all of the local community when I express my sympathy for the victims, their family and their friends. Words are never sufficient at a time like this, but the plight of the victims must be on the, on the minds and in the hearts of all of us now and in the days ahead. And uh, Mike Bowron of the States of Jersey Police uh, also left uh, this comment. With the deepest condolences from all of the officers and staff at the States of Jersey Police, Mike Bowron, Chief Officer. Uh, St. Helia has been really shocked by the, the events. Uh, the Honorary Police of the parish have been working with their colleagues across the island to help the States of Jersey Police uh, in the immediate aftermath of the, the tragedy. Uh, but what I think has been most stirring and most encouraging is the way the community has really come together to support uh, the victims. And this uh, weekend event, raising money to help uh, the expenses of the, of the funerals and to provide a community fund that will be available in the future should any other uh, calamities of this sort occur. Uh, I've been very, very impressed by the way people have given of their time and of their money and uh, I hope that this weekend will raise significant funds for this community appeal. I'm now going to hand over to Anna Godlewska who's going to say a few words I think in English and in Polish. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to read the letter from uh, Her Excellency Ambassador Barbara Tugarecińska. On behalf of Mrs. Ambassador, entire staff of the Polish Embassy, and on my own behalf, I would like to wholeheartedly thank all the parties involved in the organization of this concert in memory of these members of the local Polish community who died tragically in St. Helier on 14th August. I would also like to express our utmost gratitude to Jersey authorities and all the agencies involved for their immediate response, professional approach and great efficiency in the actions taken to support the Polish community in Jersey following the tragic event. I would also like to address special thanks to the St. Helier Council, Mr. Simon Crowcroft and Mrs. Magda Milewska. The concerts which are taking place today and tomorrow, including performance from Poland and Jersey, have resulted from a spontaneous reaction of your communities which united and supported each other under such tragic circumstances. This can only show how strong we are, even in the face of something which is almost impossible to comprehend. I am convinced that events like these can give us hope and belief in the strength of our humanity and form a strong basis for the continued bond between both Jersey and Polish communities. With the trust that we can only hope for the better now and the Polish nationals living and working here in Jersey will become even more reassured 
that they are welcome here on this island and that they have truly become full members of local society. Once again, please be assured of our gratitude and utmost respect. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Anna. I think all it remains for me to do is to thank a couple of people who've made this festival possible. Uh, Jason Maindonald, Bernie Manning, and Richard McKenzie have been working very hard and I think are still working very hard around us uh, preparing the festival, so we thank them. Uh, I want to thank Mag Magda very much, I can't pronounce her surname, uh, for her work uh, and, and her support of the community. Uh, my colleagues at the Parish of St. Helia uh, for their support and all the stool holders uh, and the musicians are going to be playing later. So thank you to everyone involved and it's now my pleasure uh, and my honour to declare the uh, festival uh, to raise money for the Victoria, Victoria Crescent Appeal officially open. Thank you. Thank you.